You know, we've talked a lot about Bentonville being the mountain biking capital of the world. We've said that a few times. I think it's, at last check, the ticker says like 52 times. Okay. I'm not 100% <laughs> sure that's correct, but 52 times. Recently, though, we found out about rural roads and respecting rural roads. As we were told, not all of our roads need to be paved. It's one of the most common sites in all of Bentonville. Bikes. Recently, as a way to make backcountry biking safer, the state of Arkansas launched a pilot program called R3, or Respect Rural Roads. The plan is to designate specific gravel cycling routes on county roads in northwest Arkansas and then to the rest of the state. Here's cycling enthusiast and R3 advocate Tom Walton. Gravel roads are safer yeah. than yeah. riding on pa uh, pavement and not everybody wants to mountain bike. Right. So the, and then it's a wonderful way to really get out and see the beauty of Arkansas. So we believe in it. Signage around the state will caution motorists to share the unpaved roadway. We can be the gravel capital of the world as well as the mountain bike capital. We don't have to just do mountain bikes, right? right? The infrastructure is here. In Benton County alone, there's more than 800 miles of gravel road and 500 miles of dirt road. All of this leading to quite the uncommon ride. Mountain biking is kind of like being on the front side of like a ski area, a ski mountain or something like that. The gravel riding is kind of the back country. Right. So it's much more exploratory. It's an adventure. You're not sure what you're going to see. And for Walton, this new adventure not only allows for a unique ride, but also a chance to be first, staking a claim to a gravel way of life. So we think we can win. And this is like an attempt to kind of get out there first and test whether or not we can build more lo local audience and then also become a place where people travel to ride. And so we embark on the next chapter of the cycling community in Bentonville, taking a gravel road to what's next. One thing I learned from the trail development here is that there's trapped value in preserving and, and, and creating these amenities. And I think there's the same opportunity with preserving some of the gruel routes that are here in Benton County because of, they're just different experiences.